Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm, 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 I'm so glad that you are aware of it. You know he's one of America's most committed composers. This man has written so much music. And it's always been right in the pocket. I mean, he's oh, I mean, he's written a lot of music. I'm learning about music from her. <laughs> well, you know, but if you told him about the Horace Silver, you should just take, I mean, you know, and uh, and lyrics as well. I mean, you see, a lot of composers uh, will just write, you know, there's a lot of jazz composers who just uh, write uh, instrumentals. Like, well, Duke Ellington was an exception. He wrote about something like Seven Prayer Post in the 2000, and a lot of lyrics. And, and his uh, right hand man, uh, Billy Strayhorn, together they wrote, you know. And uh, now, the, the, the other great American composer is Van Short. Are you familiar with him? Really? And he's influenced a lot of people, but he didn't write that much lyrics. Now, people wrote lyrics to his lyrics, but Paul so wrote music and you know, instrumental and lyrics to his lyrics. And a lot of it's, you know, and he's got this thing, you know. He was like, I think he was a vegetarian, so he wrote a lot of songs, you know, about that. <laughs> That's cool. So, how'd you get into jazz? Uh, well, actually, I was in the Well, I grew up on it. My parents, you know, that's, that's what I heard every, every Saturday, you know, especially on Saturdays because that was cleanup day. That's what we had. We had all these chores. Right, right. Turn on the desk, clean up the room. I might, you know, be in the dust, clean the bathroom, you know, the whole thing. You know, we had chores to do. I understand. We had the same thing. I grew up on it. But then I uh, acted when I picked up the one, though. Uh, it was two minutes of kale that they were supposed to be too. Actually, two things. And two is my way of life. Wow. Yeah. So, you know, you know, are you familiar with him? He's a legendary South African uh, trumpet player. Yeah. So, how did you get into it? So, I was going to ask you, so, why, how Trump or why Trump? He just. He just well, uh, okay. Yeah, thank you. Uh, All right. It seemed like when I was about 19 and I dropped out of college, I needed. So, and, and, you know, fortunately, that's what I've been doing. 